Hi there, Libra. I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars. Whole new start for you, Libra. In fact, this is such a positive week for most star signs, but for you, you have a solar eclipse, which is um, very intense new moon energy in your 10th solar house. Okay, so it's your house of career and business. So this signifies a whole new start um, and a whole new cycle. So it's your next 12 month cycle beginning. Um, to do with work. So if you've been waiting on changes to come through at your office or perhaps alterations to your job, then this is the week or over this period, next immediate period of time when that can all happen. Okay, so um, your advice here, Libra, is really not to think about it too much, not to worry about the how and when or why. Uh, just be ready to go with the flow when the pieces start to fall into place. Uh, you know, when you stop to think about it, too much then sometimes you can even like miss an opportunity so s certainly um, give yourself some you know free time to think things through which is not always easy for a Libra to do because you're you know so busy on a social level um, but you know if you can just allow yourself to have faith that things will work out and as the pieces you know the jigsaw puzzle sort of falls into place then um, Tune into your instincts. If it feels right, it probably is. If it doesn't feel right, it probably isn't. Okay. Um, but big things happening there. Now, you could be traveling as well. Um, and to do on a personal nature. So, you know, with Mars and uh, sitting in your ninth house with... Um, uh, Uranus and your seventh house, and those two connecting on a positive level, then it can, you know, spark action of some sort uh, to do with uh, either travel or perhaps you'll be, you know, starting a new study up on some level. Either way, it's all good, okay? So have a great week, Pis um, Libra, and uh, thanks for watching. I'm Jennifer Angel. We'll see you next week.